Mmm, it's cold, but not cold enough. Eh, it's colder, but still not cold enough. Nope, 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 not cold enough. If we want real cold weather, we gotta go to Alaska. It's a lovely winter day here in Northern Virginia and the Nichols family thinks it's not cold enough. We are going to Alaska. We're gonna be camping, ice fishing. It's gonna be pretty awesome. All right, you guys ready to go to Alaska? It's 2.30 in the morning Anchorage time. That makes it 6.30 in the morning Virginia time, but we made it. <laughs> we are gonna go get some sleep and I will see you in the morning. I hate you. I and so hate you. <laughs> we've slept like a total of maybe four hours, but we're up and Melanie's up too and it's an exciting new day and we're gonna have fun while the high lasts. <laughs> well, I anticipate us doing some serious winter camping so I had a bunch of reindeer hides shipped to Melanie's house and I'm excited to go test them out. We walked next door to Grandma and Grandpa's house and the boys are getting their groove on to some Bon Jovi. Is that cozy? Yeah. Maybe. Three degrees Fahrenheit outside. Let's go get some winter clothes, shall we? All right, if you need serious cold weather gear, especially in big boy sizes, this is a great place to go. Come on. Got myself a set of negative 40 boots. Got these insulated pants here that go under your bibs. All right, guys, we bought out half the store. We are so geared up. Well, we did some shopping. Now we need to get some lunch. So we're here at the fire tap and we're gonna get some food for Becca and for the boys. You guys hungry? Yeah! Oh, look at the size of that pretzel. Mm. Mustard and cheese. <laughs> All right, Nate, you're true Alaskan. You're gonna run barefoot through the snow just to avoid having to put shoes on. <laughs> cold feet, cold feet. <laughs> The nice thing about the winters is you get long nights and lots of time to cuddle up as a family and spend some time together. The next morning. Well, it is a brisk negative six and we're heading off to church. Got the kids loaded up and this car may never warm up. It's so cold. <laughs> you guys ready to go to cold church? Yeah. We're driving back home from church and there's a big old moose on the uh, side of the road. Oh, you don't want to pet it. Those things will kill you. Over to Grandma's house. We're having an army men battle here, okay? Oh, I got the stealth fighter! Yeah! Oh, you took out my rifleman! Oh! Oh, that destroyed so many brave young men. I love it. I've got my full parka on and the boys are donning ski goggles to go visit my grandpa. Yeah, and I may go. Oh, Tommy, you're getting so big. One thing, another. you guys got the goggles on. Well, it's 4:30, so the sun's setting. Time to go get some dinner. Well, we've had a great time visiting with family, but we are so tired. The jet lag has caught up to me, so it's like nine o'clock. I'm going to bed. I'll see you guys in the morning. All right, we got Ninja Tommy and Nathan. We are dressed up for walking out to the warm car. Yeah. <laughs> you excited for some reindeer sausage? Yeah. 
Look, Look at that. I have fun. <sighs> I'm still warm. But we're gonna go in the garage here and uh, we're gonna make a rocket stove. And I've got to go and sharpen up the ax here a little bit before I go camping tomorrow. I got a big birch log here. And we're gonna turn this thing into a rocket stove so we can cook some trout on it while we go ice fishing. Oh, there we go. We can see light. No, he just... He's in the All right, get dressed. Are you stuck? I can't get off! Run! Me! There you go. And we're here at a little city lake inside of Anchorage, and we're gonna try to catch some little stocked rainbow trout. Behold. All right, let's try this spot. Oh, looks like the rest of the... Here, yeah! Oh. Fresh one. So. Okay, reel it in, reel it, pull it up. Oh. Yeah, oh, oh. there we go. Oh, yeah. It's such a cute little fish. <laughs> Little stock trout. It was so easy. Nathan, you want to cook them? Little tiny rainbow trout, little stocked rainbow trout. You want to eat some trout? Come over here. Here, I'll feed you. Here, here's a little bit of trout right there. I'm a taste mm. I was going to taste so yummy. Yeah, you want some? All right, well, guys, well, let's pack it up and we're going to head back. Was that fun? Yeah. Good morning. It's a beautiful Wednesday. The sun is not up and me and Nathan are getting up, heading into the car, and we're gonna be driving out into the mountains for some camping. Come on, let's go get some food. I'll, I'll take a fritter if that's okay. Hey look, Nathan, there's ice for sale. Oh, that's a good fritter, it's still warm. Mm. Well, it's a balmy six degrees Fahrenheit here, and uh, I think it's a perfect day to go camping. <laughs> All right, I think this is where we're going to make our campsite right here. Cold out. There you go, you got buddy. Na, 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 you, want, you want a little rolling steak juice? You don't want to sleep in your sleeping bag? Yeah, I'll just sleep under the hide. You want to just sleep under the caribou hide. All right. That's crazy. Nathan, buddy. Buddy, wake up. You slept in a lot. What happened? I had to do it spit it out because there was some trash in my mouth. <laughs> yeah, keep going. Meanwhile, we're going to Whittier with with Grandma and uh, Grandpa. Luke is camping over by where Start. the the sun is showing on the mountain. We might go see him. Well, here we are. We're waiting to go through the Whittier Tunnel. We have to go on a schedule to get through the tunnel because it's just one lane and then trains go through sometimes too. Coming while we're driving through see it. See the train tracks in there? Yeah, but it's not going today. Well, we hope not. Yeah. It'll be bad if one fell on us. It's unbelievable. There's not hardly any snow here at all. Good job Dal's ever had. I actually, I'm learning how We're gonna go see if we can find Luke and Nathan. Hey, hey. oh, there's Becca. We thought we 
come check out what you're doing. And all of a sudden I see this little boy walking down the road. I'm like, that looks just like Tommy. It is Tommy. <laughs> they stopped by to say hi, and it's the best surprise ever. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you're <laughs> <living> well. <laughs> Two hours later. Oh, I was so sore and tired. Yeah, go poo, buddy. You don't poo when you're winter camping. You just hold it until spring. Well, you know, we had the reindeer hides we were camping with. Well, I wanted something a little bit more because I knew it was going to be super cold. So I actually ordered a buffalo hide. Unfortunately, it came a day too late. But here it is. So maybe we're going to have to do another, another video. Real buffalo hide. One. Wow, that's so big. See, the problem with the reindeer hides is it takes two to cover me. So I needed just a bigger animal hide. So, buffalo it is. I am exhausted and I am going to lay on a couch for a very long time. But my sweet wife here is going to the Imaginarium or some sort of kids museum with grandma and the boys. So she's going to do the filming. Well, let's go in. comes back. All right, let's go over to Grandma's house for dinner. Hi. You got something on your back. Show us your dance moves. I got the Man, you guys got dance moves. Numa, numa, yay. Numa, numa, yay. I'm editing video. I'm gonna watch a movie and go to go to bed very early. So I'll see you guys tomorrow morning. All right, guys, let's go sledding. Go and get dressed. Get dressed, we're going sledding. We're at the park? Yeah, we're at the park. Yeah. Jesse, you need to get all the way up there. <laughs> I get you, buddy. <laughs> all right. Well, we're here at Ocean View Bluff Park, right around sunset, which means it's like three. <laughs> I think this is the first time with the boys that they've ever gone sledding on any real hill. Hey, hey Jacob, you wanna go sledding? Here comes Danny and Jacob! Hi! Oh, it was fun except for all the spray in the face at 8 degrees, that's cold! Put your feet inside the sled, there you go! You're right, that's a good idea! Mom's corpse has joined us. Here, Mama. You alive? Yeah. <laughs> I'm not good at staying forward. This place brings back a lot of memories. This was our local park growing up as a kid. Hey, Tommy, what do you think of sledding? Good. <laughs> this is fun, is it? Backwards every time. <laughs> Let's try out Big Bertha over here.
<laughs> this might be the last run of the day. Let's do it. This trip is going by fast, isn't it? too fast. It's kind of romantic. We're sitting watching the sunset and it's a really long sunset. Oh yeah, it's the slow jam of sunsets. Yeah. Oh yeah. Is that a smile? Are you having fun? There's a smile. Tavi, are you having a ball? Yes. <laughs> I do not want to leave our seat here all night, all day, all night, all day, and sled. <laughs> you ready? Last run. Make a count. Ready. Daddy, got this, Daddy. Get your sled. Get your sled. Oh, the sled. Well, good morning. Me and the boys are frantically getting ready because we are traveling into the interior of Alaska to do some hardcore ice fishing. It's supposed to be like negative 17 or something out at Lake Louise. We better bring our winter gear. <laughs> Plan to leave at 10, pull it out at noon. That's how we roll. <laughs> Are your reindeers buckled up? Yes. Good. Oh, I told you the whole time. Oh, Connect River is all steamy. Look at all that. I think we're here and we're with Jake from How To Alaska and we're swinging by here and they're just uh, showing us a little hospitality and a good time. If you guys have never seen his channel, definitely check it out. Look at this. This is as Alaskan as you get. A young lady on her pink snow machine doing laps around a dead caribou. That is Alaska. <laughs> for underwater footage. All right, Nate, you want to try this? This makes it go and this stops it, okay? Yeah. Nathan, did you like that? Yeah. Did you have loads of fun? Yeah, I'm to do it some more. We got caribou ribs here from the ones out in the yard. That's locally sourced. I heard that's a good thing. Yeah. You want you want to eat some caribou meat? No. We need to clean out one because it's full of like beaver. <laughs> but you know what I mean. You know people. This is so good. Nathan, Tommy, you got it's time to go. Are you having fun with friends? Yeah. Do you want to stay here or do you want to go fishing? Yeah, I know you do. Alright guys, you ready to go up Lake Louise? Yay! Let's do it. You gonna sleep with me? Well guys, we're here at the Point Lodge at Lake Louise. We are gonna be doing some serious ice fishing tomorrow. But tonight, we are going to take it easy, eat some food, and just uh, relax a little bit. I have diesel underwear! What the? The boys and I are getting ready for negative 20 degrees Fahrenheit. It's got a different walk than one We have got piles and piles of clothes here. Nathan, are you ready to get bundled up? Yeah. Inside the shack, it's warm. All right, here we go. Oh, it's nice and warm inside. I Hold on. Get it. 
It's, we are darn close to negative 40 degrees Fahrenheit, which for all you people who like metric system out there is negative 40 Celsius. Now Patrick over here has no gloves, just pure manliness. Yeah, he's, he's scooping the ice out with his bare fingers because he is the Alaskan man. Hey Nathan, are you having fun? <laughs> Tommy, you having a good time? Yeah. You are? Yeah, I want to stay. I want to stay. I want to keep on doing this for the rest of the trip. See, look right there. It's coming right up. That fish came right up off the bottom. And he's he is checking you out right there. There's a fish just, on here. Oh, it is. Get out here. Oh, I can unhook him. Oh, these guys got teeth on them. Oh, look at that. Here. Oh, look at that. My first lake trout ever. Do you want some go. apples and stuff? There we go. He said <laughs> He's fighting. Rod that bendy. Oh! oh! That's a, that's a, that's a huge one. Here. That's a huge one. What are we doing? There. Oh! Yeah. oh. Dad, look at that. Look at that beauty. That is a beautiful, beautiful lake trout, bud. Yeah. Ugh. Look at that. That is bright. That's orange, oh, almost yeah. like a salmon. Yep. Daddy. Oh. <laughs> Slow dig, do 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 oh, dig it yeah. easy, do 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 do. So my brother here, he has in his hand. Let me let me let me get that in the light. Oh, look at look at that. This is seal oil, a traditional Native Alaskan delicacy. It's hard to get a hold of, and Brett Kirk from No Attack hooked us up here and it's got some uh, seal oil with some dried bearded seal meat floating in there and a chunk of white fish. First I've got to smell this. Oh that is a that is a pungent smell. Do you know what that smells like to me? What? Cured salmon eggs. To me it smells like um, like a cooking oil with a little bit of seafood in it. You got a, you got a chunk of dried seal meat there? Out there. Dried be it's a rib meat. Rib meat of a bearded seal. And it's dried, not smoked, right? No, it's it's not cooked, it's dried. Just dried. That's intense. Really? Kind of rehydrated in my mouth a little bit. <laughs> and it's just like I bit a chunk out of a seal. <laughs> oh, <I'm... laughs> nope, that's frozen. That's, that's, that's... <laughs> <laughs> Chug a lug. Stop. <laughs> we just come sprinting over and the rods all oh, the way bent that. over. That's been oh. more than mine did. <laughs> Gonna need a bigger hole. Oh, oh. oh no! Keep going, keep going. There, there. No. Oh, pull, pull, pull. Pull, pull. Oh, it uh, snapped. It oh, damn. Yeah, it was all, the hole was all froze up. <laughs> Well, we've had an absolute ball here and we'd love to fish longer, but we've got to drive all the way back to Anchorage tonight. Did you guys have fun ice fishing? Yeah! Awesome! Well, it's a beautiful Sunday morning and our last day here in Alaska. We are going to church and then we're gonna visit some family and then we have to pack up and go home. Becca, what was your favorite part about the trip? Uh, seeing family, uh, driving to Whittier, and painting with your mom. Hey, tell me, what was your favorite part of the trip? Flooding. What was your favorite part of this trip? When you guys left. Say, say goodbye to cousins. <laughs> Thank you.
it's so good to be home. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and coming along with us on our vacation and adventures. If you want to see more great travel adventures from the Outdoor Boys YouTube channel, we've got a whole playlist full of those adventures. Don't forget to click subscribe. We put out new videos every Saturday morning. If you like this video, don't forget to check out the Outdoor Boys YouTube channel where we have hundreds of videos just like this. And don't forget to click subscribe so you can see other great videos every Saturday morning. And hit that bell button so you'll get notifications. Thanks for watching.